okay before we start uh, we need to download all the files in the description and then type in terminal on the search and on your phone go ahead and look for developer options if you don't have that just go and scroll uh, on about and click on build number seven times and then uh, get into developer options and enable Android debugging click on OK okay so on step one we're going to unlock the bootloader on your computer once you download ADB bundle uh, just uh, copy it to your main folder it's the home folder with the little house and look for the folder platform tool on your terminal type in CD and drag the folder there enter next we should uh, type in dot slash adb devices and that's what we'll do we'll look for our device once it's successful you will see a message on your phone that just click ok good so now uh, we should type in adb reboot bootloader all the, the code will be in the description don't worry about typing anything I just copy it and paste it on the uh, terminal uh, next we will do fast boot and then OEM unlock and this will unlock our phone and allow us to install a custom recovery this process will wipe your uh, phones information so please back up all your pictures and documents before doing this then once it's done just log into your google account and you will be set for the next step all right so step two we're needing to install a customer recovery so go to your setting and uh, scroll to about phone we will be enabling developer options again okay so once we uh, get the developer options get in and then enable advanced reboot disable update cm recovery and enable Android debugging okay always and okay one more time on your phone I'm sorry on your terminal type in ADB devices and then ADB reboot bootloader You should see the logo again. Then type in dot slash fast boot flash recovery. And then on your download folder, look for your custom recovery and then drag it again to the terminal and click on enter. Once it's successful, we need to type in dot slash flash fast boot sorry reboot and that's it your phone have a custom recovery okay on step three we're going to root with the super su and just launch your android file transfer app you will find this on the description and copy your super su file that you downloaded to the main directory on your phone push the power button and click on a reboot recovery okay All right, so uh, let's click on install and uh, look for our file. Okay, swipe to confirm. What once it's done, uh, click on wipe uh, cache and Dalvik, and click on back, 
and reboot. Congrats, your phone now is unlocked, have a custom recovery, and you have root access. Thank you for watching, and see you in the next one.